Hello and welcome back to our lessons. In this video, we are going to learn how to use the full page auto comment reply. There are cases where we want to add an auto comment reply for all of our Facebook posts, whether it is on our page public post or for all of our Facebook ads posts. And if we are using the same configuration for all of those posts, it's a hassle to configure each and every one of those posts and add an auto comment reply for them. There is a solution for that. What you need to do is use Use the full page auto comment reply feature. What I want to do is simply drag and drop the crown button here. So drag the crown button and drop it on the campaign that you want to become a model. And just as easy as that, we have already added a full page auto comment reply campaign. What happens now is whenever a Facebook user comments on any of our Facebook posts, whether it is on Facebook ads or on our Facebook page, then the user will receive an auto comment reply using the configuration that we have set on this campaign. So essentially, this campaign became our model campaign. So let's test this out. Let's go to our Facebook page and comment on any of our Facebook posts. All right, we are now on our Facebook page. To make sure that the post that we are using to test the full page auto comment reply does not have an existing comment auto reply campaign attached to it, we are going to create a new post. And let's say this is a totally new post. And then let's post this. All right, we have already created a new post. What we are going to do next is we are going to test this post. We are going to open this on a new tab. Now this post is opened on a new tab. And to test this post, as usual, we're going to use our Facebook personal profile. So select our personal profile here and test the post. This is a test comment. You can see that we have received an auto comment reply here. So even if this is a totally new post and we haven't added any auto comment reply campaign for this, yet we still received an auto comment reply. This is because we have enabled the full page comment reply and the configuration here is the same as the model model configuration that we have set here. So if we check edit, you can see that this is the exact same message that we have received on our reply. Now, how do we remove the full page comment reply? All we have to do is go back to your campaign and to remove this, simply drag the crown back to its placeholder. And just like that, we have removed the auto comment reply. Now, we can add this to any of our campaign. We can even transfer this to one of the campaigns. Simply drag the crown to another campaign and it will become the new model. So that's how easy it is to add, remove, and transfer the auto comment reply to another campaign. Simply drag the crown. And if you want to disable the full page auto comment reply campaign, simply drag the crown back to its holder and just like that, we have disabled the full page campaign. So that marks the end of this lesson. I hope you learned a lot how to enable the full page comment reply. So see you on the next video.